All right, I'm rolling. So, um, you know, first off, just tell us your name and how you spell it, and then. Um, I'm Ariana Powell, A R I A N A P O W E L L. Um, I go to Inspire School of Arts and Sciences. I am 15 and a junior. Um, I am the vice president of student government as well as the um, student representative and student government representative for the Jeans for Teens um, uh, Inspire Drive. Uh, I also help create it um, along with uh, Lisa and Ms. Horst. Um, my job really is that I, I'm mainly in charge of donations. I help, um, I help organize all the donation rooms. I help organize all incoming donations. I also uh, handle like um, monetary donations and that kind of stuff. Um, and sometimes I'll work the front of room and help people find stuff. All right, and um, so what exactly is Jeans for Teens? Jeans for Teens is an organization uh, that was started. Um, that it was it was mainly just to find to find and give jeans to students in a time of need. In this uh, case, the campfire, but uh, it it just expanded into other clothes as well. Um, so it's clothing for teens in need. Cool. Yeah, and I saw there was a lot of other items in there as well. Could you explain what I need that? Uh, so there are jeans, shirts, uh, both for men and women and children. Uh, there's other types of pants that aren't jeans. There are There's uh, tons of accessories, some toiletries, uh, purses, suitcases, uh, as well as some children's stuff like diapers and food and all that. And I know that, you know, most everyone has been affected one way or another by the fires. Um, can you tell us a story about how you have been personally affected by the fire? Um, I did not have any family that was affected by the fire, but I do have a few really close friends that were affected by the fire. And I know it's just like messaging them and talking to them in person. It's like, it's so heart wrenching and heartbreaking because it's like they lost their homes and they have to rebuild. It's yeah. Yeah. And um, so I know we're pretty early on here um, in thinking about rebuilding, but how do you feel like um, we are going to be able to maybe rebuild <laughs> when it comes to uh, the youth? and the education um, in our community? Well, that's kind of tough. I mean, I hope, I mean, uh, obviously Paradise Streets are gonna come here to the schools in Chico, and hopefully we can work, the, we can work them into our study plans and, um, and just make sure that they keep on going, making, make sure that they get all the good grades that they need so that they can, especially for seniors, so that they can get into colleges and universities. And yeah. yeah. All right, is there anything else that you'd like to add? Um, maybe about Inspire and, and all the help and oh, people yeah. that have kind of... Um, I just, like with this drive, there's been so many volunteers. There's been um, multiple regulars that have come uh, every day or almost every day. Um, if, uh, and then there's some that just come and help out for a day and they do so much. Uh, the people in Inspire are just so amazing and I know that when there's students that are coming in they're going to do so much to help them and get them through what they need to get through. Yeah, I've seen even students who have lost their homes here. Yeah, and it's, it's really nice that they're help, that they're, they're doing, they're helping too. Helping people like themselves. <laughs> yeah. All right, anything else that you want to add? I don't think thank so. Thank you. Okay, thank you, Ariana, for uh, organizing this. Really appreciate it. And uh, I know the community does too. All right, now.